Hey, what's up you guys? Shardimus Prime here, doing a quick addendum video on the Transformers Masterpiece MP51 RC figure. I just reviewed this late yesterday, thanks for everybody that checked out that video. Uh, it was missing a couple of things. Uh, first off, really quick, I want to give a shout out to Ben uh, Putulin for pointing out the mistransformation right here on the backpack. So I did not notice this, um, even though I was closely reading the directions, but yeah, you're able to flip these up just a little bit farther than I demonstrated. So you can get a full 90 degrees right over here with these white flaps right over here at the bottom. And that does help a whole lot with porting a stand into that Kulo port right over there. So that is dope. I'm happy. It's even more compact than it was before. And then uh, Chassis Van and Vurio had pointed out that I did not show the articulation at all in the video. I recorded it. I just forgot to show it. So um, I rewatched it too before I posted it. And I don't know how I let that slip. It's probably because I was working on the next video. So anyway, I'm going to show off the articulation segment later today. Expect a Marvel Legends Spider-Man update video. And then tomorrow, Hot Toys Far From Home Upgraded Suit Spider-Man. So let's move on to that articulation segment. Now, when I talk about the articulation being like SH Figure Arts, I know it's not the same. I just feel like that's the direction that Takara Tomy is trying to head towards. Anyway, you can move the head all the way up. That is great. And you can move her head and neck all the way down. So you do get a neck joint in there as well. A little bit of head pivoting right here too. So that's cool. And you can turn the head side to side. We have butterfly joints. I love that feature on my masterpiece figures due to the backpack right here. You can't really move it back so much, but they will bend forward or turn forward. Shoulder joints will move up over here as well, which is great. Or it's more of like the butterfly joint, but then you also get the actual shoulder joint that will rotate up. You get a bicep swivel. You get a great single jointed elbow that bends in that much. You can see it bending right over here too. So it's more like two joints. It's just one. My bad. I'm dumb. Anyway, the wrist turns side to side and they do hinge up and down. You get a thumb joint right there. You get an index finger joint and then you get the other three fingers clasping together. And then you also get a knuckle joint all the way at the bottom so she can hold a closed fist pose. So that's great. Uh, you do get a little bit of rocking forward and back right here at like the waist. I want to say this is just really above the waist, not quite the diaphragm, I guess, but you can see she rocks forward a little bit and not really back so much. She does have pivoting motion right here and you can twist side to side a little bit, not a whole lot, but she will just turn that much. For the legs, they'll move outward just that much and she can, I mean, due to transformation, she can kick all the way up that far if you wanted to you know shift this outward you can get her kicking forward like that if you wanted to go chino why would you want to do that but then you know remember to shift back into place this is always really finicky you want to make sure you do it while the leg is facing at the 90 degree mark and then turn back down uh, you do get a mid thigh cut right here which is a really stiff joint it's always tricky to move that one but you can see it rotating right there you get great double jointed knees so her legs bend in that much at the knee and then the ankles do turn down they will rotate upward and she has beautiful ankle pivot right there as well as the toe articulation so there you have it thanks again you guys for watching sorry for the oopsies i try to make up for my mistakes you know so hopefully this does the trick if you missed the full review make sure you check that out of course and i will catch you guys later peace Hey, new Sharpness Prime videos. Hey, you should click one. Yeah, click on one of them. Or subscribe if you haven't.